So lesson two uh, runs from the 22nd through the 29th. Assignments are due on the 29th. Uh, and we have a reading assignment, we've got the lecture demo, and we have the lab assignment. The reading assignment, again, you're going to be able to read uh, chapters from the book or web resources. So I've got all of these web resources, or you can read the chapter from the book, or you can read any combination. Okay, so totally up to you. Uh, and then we have the key concepts lecture on functions, methods, and objects. And so this goes into a lot more detail, um, you know, what those readings covered. Uh, and I actually have videos for each of the sections in the lecture demo, and I stuck them into a playlist. So if you want to pull up the playlist, you could actually watch the video while you are going through each section. Hey, and the videos, I mean, basically go through all of the code. I've got lots and lots of examples for you guys to play with. You know, number of inches you want converted to centimeters. Okay, so I try to uh, make these as interesting as possible. Uh, and then um, if you wanted to review more on JavaScript functions, I have a reference link for you. Uh, we get into scope. You can see there's the video here. Okay, so as you go through these, um, this is a scope example here. Um, here's a scope error. And it's really important in this class uh, that you, let me see, let me finish this quick. Don't know. All right. So it was supposed to display back all that information, but you can see that it didn't. So that means I have an error. So if I press uh, F12, I can get into the developer panel. And on my laptop, I have to do Fn and F12. Okay, But I'm not seeing the error yet because I'm in the network tab. There is an error. So if I click on that, I can actually see it. Uh, it's a reference error. Movie is, it's, there's a problem with movie. So if I click here, that'll take me to the line in the code where the problem occurred. And let's see, what is the problem with movie? All right, so I've got name defined up here. And then I've got a function. And in the function, is where I defined movie, song, and sport. So if you define something within a function, that is the only place they can be used. So then when I come down here and I'm trying to access movie, song, and sport, those are not gonna work because they only exist inside here. Okay, so that is what it's referring to with reference error. Okay, so it is trying to, uh, tell you where the error is. It does a pretty good job of flagging the location, uh, but you just have to kind of get used to the messaging. It is saying um, the movie is not defined. Okay, so that kind of clues you in that you have to go up to where you declared a movie and try to figure out why doesn't it recognize movie down here? Okay, so I've got a lot of these kind of examples built into these lectures. So here you can see it's resolved. Uh, naming collisions is another issue. Uh, the video on this section will go through and explain what these problems are and how to overcome them. So there's literally videos for everything in here. So you definitely want to go through this and watch the videos so you understand what you're doing then you can do the assignment. And so this assignment, uh, we are going to first add folders so that we have the proper structure. Um, I have a playlist for this assignment as well. I do give you a starter file that you are gonna wanna download. And then here's a video that explains what you need to do. 
Uh, and this is what you need to do for part one. Part two, there's a video that explains what you need to do. And then there's also a video for part three. Uh, for this next task, you need to do something similar to this. So let's see. Well, how do we spell month? I should know how to spell this. I have this dog. Okay. Just count. All right. So you can see uh, that uh, the first information I entered shows up here. This is hard coded and you will have to do something similar. So you can have people interactively enter a couple objects or you will be able to hard code them. I really don't care which one. Okay. Um, but the video here will explain what you need to do. And this example shows you. Okay. And then I've got code example here as well. Uh, once you're done, you're going to transfer the pages. You do need to add links to your assignment page so that I can pull up your assignment page. I can click on data types. It takes me to that page. I can click on multiple objects. It takes me to that page. Um, you don't need to link in the JavaScript or the CSS because I will be able to see that from your page. So you just need to link in the main page. Uh, let's see, Spike. No. All right, so if I right click and I go to view page source, you can see that I can get to the CSS and the JS from here. So there's no need to link those into your assignment page because I have access to those. Okay, so uh, that is the assignment. Uh, for additional resources, I've got additional information on functions, objects, and prototypes. I also have a PowerPoint that went with the ebook textbook. And once you are done, do not forget to come into this Dropbox and add a submission of done. If you run into problems or if you have questions, please reach out, send me an email. Um, if you are in the live stream class, uh, ask, ask for help. Usually there's a uh, time at the end of class on, la on lecture days. And then of course we have the entire lab session where I can help you. Um, if you turn something in and there is a problem, you will be allowed to fix it and resubmit. But when you guys submit done, I do expect your code to work. So do not submit done if you have errors on your page. If you have errors on your page, you need to ask for help. Okay. Um, so uh, I am here to help you. Please reach out if you need it and have a great week.